right, welcome back. We are here with another gameplay video as PDO4. The last one I did, it was um, a gameplay video showing you how the LSPDO4 expanded gameplay works inside the game. A few things about it. It's not everything, but it's a few things about it. As you can see right here, um, showing a few different things. You can get tattoos on here or whatever. Um, what else do you have? They go your gas, you can get gas. I didn't show you that. I should have. I may show you in this video here. But um, you can get gas on there. Buy clothes, as you can see. It's a few things you can do, right? So, and the vehicle store. Buy cars or whatever. So I may show you in this video here on how more of this stuff look inside the game. Um, so let's go ahead and dive into it. So this is the install. I'm gonna put the link down in the description below for you to click on and just go straight to it. You just download it. Well, I already got it downloaded. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you the install part itself. So once you download it, it should look like this right here. This is the um, old version that I have. LSP therefore I spent it 1.0.0, but I did update it um, previously, I think yesterday or whatever, but I do have the uh, most recent version. So once you do that, it'll click on it. You're gonna pull up this uh up to your Renoir. It's a pretty much it's a pretty simple install. Like any other plugin, go to the README. It'll show you um the contents in your you just put it in your Grand Theft Auto main directory. Uh, be a plugins folder. So just come over here. Hold up, let's bring this down. Double click it, and you got the plugins folder here, Rage Native UI, and it's pretty much up to date. It's March 26th. And it's also just raised the UI uh, DLL. Everything is up to date here. So you can just take all of this and install it into your main directory, which is right over here. And Steam apps coming and Grand Theft Auto 5. Just take this, take all of these, boom, drag and drop. Okay. And you will see it over here in the plugin section and LSPDF4. And right here. There we go. We got LSPDF4 expanded. And you, you scroll down. You will see your uh, where is it right here? This is your dot I and I um, portion right here. Click on double click this, it'll show you your interaction key. I changed mine to N, yours should be set to Y, and um, you can change that if you want to. Um, I got N, I is default, control key is default, and the well being is everything is default. The only thing I did different was change the interaction key and disable hunger thirst. I got mine set to true. If you set your disable hunger thirst to true, it'll show you at the bottom right hand corner if you're hungry or thirsty or whatever. I just took mine off because I didn't want that to populate in game because I'm I was always like I said I was always like um, low on life when I entered the game, low on health. So and every time I start the game up, I gotta go find something to eat, find something to drink. So I took that option off. Um, you got your holiday props here. You got your randomized time, weather, gas station. Everything is right here. You just go over it and set it how you want to set it. So that's pretty much it. It's a basic, simple install. Not really much to it. But let's go ahead and dive inside the game and show you a little bit more details about the clothing and what and, and whatnot. Let's go. Okay, now we're inside the game. Um, let's show you guys the map. Like I said in the last video. Mine looked like this because I deleted the game and I'm not sure everything just hey my map man if you know of a mod that I could download to reveal everything like before that'd be so helpful. I had one but I, I thought it worked but my game started crashing so uh this is ridiculous. But anyway, on the map you got your gas uh stations right here where you get gas at, all your food locations, and the vehicle seller. Where you buy cars and stuff like that and also you got a house you can buy houses and everything over here this this pink this pink uh icons over here that's where you buy houses at and you got your clothing store so i'm not gonna well i'm gonna go to a few of these locations but uh not all of them but just show you guys on how it works I did one last video where I watched you how to go to the um, pizza or the restaurants and how to eat the food or whatever. Let's go show you the gas station and the clothing and I guess the housing. Let's go. Okay, now we're at the gas station over here where you pull up. My first time trying this out though. Uh, let's see how this works.
Okay, I just press in, right? Let's see. I guess you get out. There we go. You get out. <laughs> My bad. You get like it's like regular game. One mile ahead, um, you pull up to the gas station. You just press the Y button while you're in the car, which does not seem realistic. But this one, you actually have to get out the vehicle, walk up, press in. He snatched it, but that's pretty much how you do it. Okay, I guess you grab that and can I put it in there? Let's see. Oh, wow. This is, hey, that's immersive, bro. Okay, now what, is it, is it pumping the gas? I'm not really sure. I think it is. I'm wondering if my well-being will show me the gas going into the car or whatever. Being that I got mine disabled. But let's let's go ahead and take it out. Press in to attach nozzle. How you put it back? There we go. He snatched, he snatched that thing, boy. Yeah. Vehicle's already full. Okay. Yeah, see, I took mine off the well. I guess it's on the well being section. All right, let's go ahead and look at the closing store right quick. Okay, here we are. It's Suburban. Let's go walk in. Okay, trying this out for the first time as well. Where is the owner? There she is. You got your hats. Oh wow, that's clean. That's clean right there. That's clean right there. I got your earrings going. Oh, I got my button set to uh, dispatch glasses. But yeah, that's how you do all of this stuff, man. Flip flops. Ha! Huh, look at that. That's crazy. But all of this stuff, once you buy this stuff here, and you got your cash in the right hand corner, I got $3,000 in my account. Once you buy your clothes and your watches or whatever, and you could, it'll be in your inventory in your closet back at your um, apartment. Now let's go check out the housing and that should be it. All right, let's see how this works. Now, this is the first time trying this out, this housing. Okay, there we go. You press in to buy this apartment. And it's $10,000, right? So, and that's that's pretty much, that's pretty simple, right? Once you buy it, it's yours. I guess you spawn here or whatever, or you can set it to where you spawn here. But that's how you set that up. But that's all about this. That's pretty much the basics, man, about this, uh, this, this mod. If you want it, go download it. I will have it linked down in the description below for you to go check it out. And hey, hope you enjoy it. But it's just pretty cool. And also watch the last video of me showing you the XP system. All right. Peace out, guys. Y'all take care and be safe.